Hello viewers, one of the important properties of concrete in its hardened state is its compressive strength. Compressive strength of concrete is important because other strengths such as flexural, bond and resistance to abrasion improve with increase in its compressive strength. The compressive strength of concrete depends upon the proportion of ingredients used in concrete. It is therefore important to find the strength of concrete using different proportions of ingredients to meet the structural requirements. In this video program, we shall demonstrate the procedure for casting and testing of cement concrete cubes. The equipment and accessories required for making the concrete cubes and testing them for their compressive strength are cube molds of 100 mm or 150 mm size with IS mark. We are using 150 mm cube molds in this case. Electronic weighing balance, GI sheet for making concrete vibrating needle, compression testing machine of capacity 100 tons, 200 tons or 300 tons depending upon the grade of concrete of which cubes are to be cast and the observation sheet to record the readings. For casting the cement concrete cubes, measure the dry proportions of ingredients as per the design requirement. For example, in this case, the proportions used for casting cubes are 1 is to 1 and a half is to 3 as per Indian standard code 456 to 1000. The dry ingredients are then thoroughly mixed so as to obtain a uniform mixture. The proportion of different ingredients taken should be sufficient enough to cast three molds. Take the designed quantity of water. Add this water to the mixture. Mix the ingredients thoroughly so as to obtain concrete with uniform texture. Using the scoop, fill the concrete into the molds. It is then compacted by means of needle vibrator ensuring thorough compaction of concrete.
after the top layer has been compacted the surface of the concrete shall be finished level with the top of the mold using a trowel it is tapped well till the cement slurry comes to the top to give it a well finished appearance After some time the molds are covered with wet gunny bag and left undisturbed for 24 hours at a temperature of 27 plus minus 2 degrees celsius at 90% relative humidity After 24 hours the specimens are removed from the mold they are then taken to be kept submerged in clean fresh water at a temperature of 27 plus minus 2 degrees celsius the specimens are kept in the water either for 7 days or 28 days water in which specimen is submerged should be renewed after every 7 days specimens when received dry should be kept in water for 24 hours before they are taken for testing the cubes are taken out of the tank just half an hour prior to the test The specimen to be tested for compressive strength should be in surface dry condition. This is the compression testing machine where the concrete cubes are tested. The capacity of this machine is 300 ton. For testing the compressive strength of cube, it is centrally placed in the loading unit. The load shall be applied to opposite sides of cubes as cast. The axis of the specimen shall be carefully aligned with the center of thrust of the spherically seated plate. Now, slowly apply load at the rate of 140 kg per centimeter square per minute till the cube breaks the maximum load at which the specimen breaks is taken as the compressive load it is 90 tons in this case recorded in the observation sheet
the compressive strength of the specimen shall be calculated by dividing the maximum compressive load taken by the specimen by its cross-sectional area. Compressive strength shall be equal to compressive load divided by the cross-sectional area of the specimen. The cross-sectional area of 15 centimeter cube is 15 multiplied by 15 centimeter which is equal to 225 centimeter square. Since the compressive load is 90 tons, the compressive strength of the cube shall be equal to 90 multiplied by 1000 divided by 225 which comes out to be 400 kilogram per centimeter square. Average of 3 readings shall be taken as the representative of the batch. In the present video program, you have seen the apparatus and the experimental procedure for casting the cube, curing of cubes and determining the compressive strength of concrete cube. Since compressive strength is the most important property of concrete, it is therefore necessary that utmost care must be exercised in measuring the compressive load. As per Indian Standard Code 516, the individual variation in compressive load should not be more than plus minus 15 percent of the average value. If the variation is more, repeat tests for the same concrete must be made. I hope after having viewed this video program, you shall be able to perform this experiment in your laboratory. Thank you.